avalanches and mudslides, never a rock slide. And that's a big one, Chris. That was a very big one. Thankfully, at least as far as we know, no hikers were in the area at the time. Uh, 67 degrees at the airport, 70 downtown. It's a mostly cloudy start to your day here in the city. It is going to be much cooler as compared to yesterday. We could see a passing shower anytime after nine. A thunderstorm likely after the noon hour. Temperatures in the 70s for the most part of your morning. We will start to climb into the 80s as we approach the noon hour and we'll spend the afternoon at least partially in the 80s before rain cools us back to the 70s. We do have some rain out on the northwestern side of the state this morning. Even a few rumbles of thunder uh, in parts of northern Route County and Jackson County. So if you're in the steamboat area and you hear thunder off to the north, it's legit. There are a few thunder showers up there uh, in Denver dry just on the mostly cloudy side. Futurecast will show uh, that threat for a few sprinkles developing as we move into the mid morning and then as we approach the noon hour and then from 12 and beyond, we'll start to see some showers and thunderstorms developing. Our fingers are crossed that any widespread precip like this holds off until after the parade ends and the rally is over. Statewide view, we're going to see numerous showers and thunderstorms across our state today. We have a pretty healthy plume of monsoon moisture in place. Most of this activity will will develop after 12 o'clock and then last into your evening. Some places could see multiple rounds of thunderstorms. In fact, and some locally heavy rain is possible. There is a flash flood watch here in West Central Colorado. This is primarily due to the Grizzly Creek burn scar there right along I-70 through Glenwood Canyon and our far eastern plains, a small threat. We could see a stronger thunderstorm develop later on today with some hail and gusty wind. So here in the city, only in the 80s today, showers and storms likely after 12, 90s on uh, the far, far eastern plains, but most of the northeast plains in the 80s, 70s in the high country, 80s to near 90 out west. Many of us are cooler uh, as compared to yesterday due to the extensive cloud cover anticipated. Tomorrow, much the same. 80s with another good chance for thunderstorms. We'll have more storms around on Saturday. Starting Sunday for Independence Eve, still a threat for an afternoon storm, but the storm chances Michelle and Dom go down next week as uh, temperatures go up. All right, Chris, thanks so much. We all know